Hey guys, and welcome back to Dead Space, where we last left off, we were going to engineering. So, let's have a little poke around, shall we? And see if we can't get things up and running again. Um, now, we've got a few small issues in engineering. Oh, hi. And I have no idea why I've got the line gun out. Oh, we've got the force gun as well. <laughs> All right, so what is going on in here? Well, it's very dark, that's for sure. Hello. Ooh, <laughs> the force gun took his bloody skin off. <laughs> oh, brilliant. All right, easy fella, easy fella. Jesus. <laughs> I nearly feel sorry for him. One shot from this bad boy, <laughs> he literally stripped his skin off like a uh, <laughs> like a paint stripper or something. That was amazing. All right, I can get used to these. Fuel preserves depleted. Main engines offline. Well, that's no good. That's no good at all. We need fuel. Apparently. Uh, oh, hello. Let's have a little look, shall we? Yeah. Oh, that's the north engines refueled. That was easy. Lovely. don't know how that's refueling the engines. Um, I'll be honest, but, you know, I'm not here to ask these questions. Yeah, looks like we've got another door up there. Thought there'd be one behind us. Oh my god, the humanity. Oh, the humanity. It's not fair, is it? not fair. You got turned inside out, Sunny Jim. I mean, I say it's not fair. I mean, I never really planned on fighting fair, to be honest. Because, well, you know, fuck those guys. Alright, what else have we got around here? That's the oxygen. We've already been down here. We need to get that. We'll call that up in a second. Let's make sure we've ticked all of our boxes around here. You don't want to leave any stones unturned because glorious valuable loot is around every corner. Oh! Ah, oh, come on, dude. You're in there turning our friendly engineers against us. Is there honestly any need for that? Yeah, you can get gibbed. And you, for that matter. You want some more, huh? Alright. What do you think of that, huh? And that. And a little bit more of that. Okay, I can do this all day. You're having a bit of a bad time there, fella. <laughs> Oh, it's so much fun. It's so much fun. See this Callisto Prodigal? Just see this? Alright, well, we've opened another door up, which is good. Let's probably switch back to the plasma cutter now. Because uh, we're burning through our ammo at a rather rapid rate here. Which, you know, it's fine. But I suppose we better save some for a, a rainy day. So, what's over here? Oh, hello. Jeez, Isaac. That, oh, need to be rank two for that. Okay. And that door is locked. That's not going to help us out much, is it? 
teamwork makes a teamwork makes a good lift happen. Um, all right. That or you could just use stasis. I'd rather I'd rather use stasis to be honest than rely on teamwork, especially with all these necromorphs around. All right. Let's have a little look over yonder. Probably more muties over here. I would imagine that would be the case. Try and turn my headset down so I can hear myself think. Um. All right, well. Feels like this platform is a little unstable. Oh, hi. Was that necessary? Oh, God. This is not going brilliantly, is it? Definitely could have been a little bit smoother. Certainly dropped the ball there. Oh, easy. Easy. Good Lord. Honestly, give these guys an inch and they'll take a mile. All right, well, job's done. Talking of taking a mile, uh, can I have that, please? Keep a memento of our time together. You know, I'm sentimental like that. Now, if there's any more of these fuckwads... Oh, would you look at that? Fuel station keycard needed. Ah, oh, that's a fly in the ointment. Last valve done, Chief! Progress report filed by Jacob Temple. The engine problems aren't a malfunction. Someone shut off the fuel lines to the primary engine and damaged the valves to hell and back. We just wasted an hour fixing them. Now we need to restart the south refueling station, but some jackass turned off the power and locked up the circuit breaker. No engines? We're gonna hit planet fall soon. What now? There's gotta be someone around here how to spare access card. Go to... Wait, you hear that? Never go! Well, that's a kick in the knickers. Me that I hit him with a good shot and it didn't hurt him, so that guy must have been uh, scripted. Hello, you on the other hand are not scripted, I guess. How do you like a little lick of flame? Huh? Huh? That's what I thought. Can't handle the heat. See, a little joke there. That's what happens when you're having fun. Okay, so. Some money. What else? A save station? I mean, okay, not bad. Ooh. Well, that was nice and easy to find. I mean, we're dropping down to like 40 frames a second. Shouldn't be happening. Thank God. After the bridge, we saw the... Glad to disappoint. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them, but I don't think they know I'm here. Isaac, I've tracked down your rig. You're an engineering, right? I'll get myself admin privileges. Maybe I can help. I guess maybe you can help. So... Right. Uh-huh, uh-huh. I'm picking up what you're putting down. Alright, so let's go and crack this bass open. I like this flamethrower. I really like this flamethrower. This flamethrower is becoming best boy. Now, oh. 
flamethrower fuel. Don't mind if I do. So lighting or life support would be rather, you know, uh, I guess we can turn off the oxygen instead of turning off lighting. Because we've got so much bloody, we've got so much bloody uh, oxygen in this suit that it's not really much of an issue. Now, we do need to keep our ears. Ah, no power. Oh. Okay. So, we need to power up this side, which is done from in there. Oh. Let's grab some air. Yeah, we've got two minutes of air. It's not really much to worry about. Oh, right. God, I'm retarded. There we go. That's better. Lovely jubbly. Now, are the mutoids going to come out? Of course they are. Oh shit, we can't use this. I guess that's because there's no oxygen in the room. That's cool. I actually think that's a really freaking cool touch. I guess we need oxygen to ignite fire because that's how science works. That was... Alright. That's a little touch. I wonder if that's a thing in the original game. Alright, anyway. That's... The engine's powered up. Right. Okay, I've got a fuel reading. Only a quarter full, but it should be enough. I still need to get the centrifuge working before restart. Someone really screwed with these fuel lines. Move fast, Isaac. Aegis 7's looking damn close out there. Yeah, we're on it. We're, oh. Oh, hello. Oh, look at these little gits. Didn't even see them. Wow. Alright. This difficulty's definitely made these guys a bit harder. See how many shots I put into that guy. Jesus. Jesus ain't here, man. Jesus ain't here at all. Where's the other one? Well, I mean, that's not the one I was looking for, but there he is. Wow, this guy's tough. Good lord. Jeez. He just kept going, didn't he? Almost ran out of oxygen. Almost. Well, what we shall do... Ah, oh, that's locked. I think I'd rather have life support on, because at least that way we can hear. Yeah, don't like not being able to hear the enemies. Because they're sneaky, sneaky bastards. And the last thing I need right now is for them to creep up and poke us in the pooper. To be honest, it's a bit awkward. Now, how much ammo do we actually have left? Quite a bit. We're good. We're okay. We're okay. And something is messing with our transporter. Again. Not happy about this. Don't really think it's necessary myself. This is a rickety old girl. And I really don't want to fall into, well, wherever that is. If that's all the same with everyone else. Right. Now. Oh, hello. 
Oh, I can hear some griblies. Oh, hello. Oh, a large med pack. Very nice indeed. Um, yeah, alright, well, we'll go. Oh. I can hear you, bastards. Here you are. As I say, no need to creep. Feel free to introduce yourself. That guy literally puked his guts up. I mean, okay. Right. Anyone else? Anyone else want to introduce themselves? I think really what they could have done with those um, weapons is they could have made them uh, ammo drop if they wanted to you know didn't need to be super stingy with it oh, it sounds like something's happening in here evening would anybody like to introduce themselves no no? Alright. Be antisocial then. See if I care. Um, right. So, the pulse rifle upgrade that we don't need. Uh, ripper upgrade, contact. Now, the contact beam. Apparently, the contact beam is beastly. So, we're going to have to try that one out at some point. There we go. Back up to 100k. Now, the centrifuge. I guess we'll drop a save. Just because. Let's go get the old centrifuge up and running. Shouldn't be too hard now, should it? How hard could it possibly be? Just a big old spinny winny thing. Flick the switch and off we go. Simples. At least I'm fairly sure it's going to be that easy. Can't imagine anything going majorly wrong with this thing. Well money. I look like a Pepsi can then. Oh, we can go through that loot room. Which is nice. I do like a good loot room. More med kits. Force energy. I like the force energy. I don't know what's in these containers. I'm going to assume it's something good. But you don't know. I can never tell. Anyway, let's go take our fan for a walk. Possibly go wrong in there, eh? Ooh, more stuff. Anything? No? Alright. So, what have we got here? <clears throat> Engineering deck log. F Hallow. Uh, check in time 17 uh, 3800 hours inspection zone blah 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 condition a subpar notification filed comments more absences it's not just the unitologist sneaking off for religious exemptions or whatever we're seeing serious gaps in the rotation people are going on uh, going on sick with sleep deprivation self-inflicted injuries or just disappearing 
They go off shift and they don't come back. Somebody said the ship has been attacked. Bullshit. We're at the arse end of nowhere. Who'd come all this way to attack a mining ship? And yeah, the captain's dead. But Carmack says one of the bridge staff killed him. I swear to God the rumours on this deck are out of control. Update. Lost contact with the bridge. No rig link. No security hardline. Nothing. Okay. This is beyond rumours. Fuck this. I'm getting out whilst I still can. Getting out where, my dude? Clearance confirmed. Hello. The hell did that bag come from? Now, one of the great things about these bags is you'll see they're actually in these lockers. But there's a glitch with the physics. Because if you notice that these bags are actually too big to fit in these lockers. So they end up just jibbing out and popping out. It's kind of weird, but whatever. Okay. So, can we do anything at the bench? We've got one node. Uh, we can actually upgrade the flamethrower. And it's a long way to get the damage upgrade, which is unfortunate. Anything on the... Uh, we've, oh, okay. We can get capacity on the line gun. Uh, laser trip damage. Okay, interesting. What about the force gun? And again, we're miles away from the force gun to get anything useful. I think we're just going to have to start spending nodes on unimportant things. Cap, cap, reload. Gravity wells have a larger radius. I have a feeling that this force gun is going to become something special. Alright. Oh, hello. Didn't even see these. Must have come down with a touch of the tards today. Right. Decon chamber. Yes. Yes. Well. Decon, you say. I'm not buying it. How does that work? Alright. Okay, let's see how these laser trip doodads work. Oh, hello. Ow. Not great against those things. Yeah, the line gun doesn't seem as good as I remember. That's not an... Yeah, it's another one of those things. Come on. Let's see it. Alright, the line gun's good if you hit him in the weak spot, but I guess that makes sense. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, okay. Yeah. Not super impressed with the line gun. I think we'll swap it out for something else. Yeah, not happy with the line gun. I remember it being a really decent, powerful weapon in the OG game. Can you burn? This guy's tough. Yeah, big dick energy, man. Decontamination sequence complete. Thank you for your patience. Yeah, I'm not a fan of that line gun at all. It doesn't seem to do a lot of damage at all. And it's area of effect. It doesn't seem to be that big. Bit disappointing. All the other weapons seem good. So far. Right. What's this way? Take our flamethrower. F Ooh, hello. Hello. 
Another node. We'll have the node. Yeah. Hello. Oh my god. Oh, the range on it. The range on it ain't bad either. Yes. I'm a fan. Preaching to the converted. Now. Oh. Oh. Right, what I need to have a look at. Yeah, what I might do. I think we're basically out of time, which is unfortunate. Let's just have a read of this text log. Rig unavailable for priority message. Transcript provided to available storage. Rig unavailable for priority message. Transcript provided to available storage. J Temple, TY, Jong, you there? Expletive. What's keeping them? The centrifuge is still offline. We're running out of time. C Danvers. No rig link. Contact since they left. Chief? They're gone, aren't they? J Temple. But we armed them with everything we had. They they'd have sent word if there was trouble. What did they fall down a expletive hole? Um expletive. Uh, there's a full tectonic load hanging off our ass. C Danvers. What if we turn off the gravity tethers, drop the load, buy ourselves some time? J Temple, I tried. Unless I rip out half the ship's wiring, it takes a CEC board member's override to drop all that ore. Can't risk expletive off the shareholders. And without that centrifuge to balance the ship, we're taking we're talking planetfall in hours, if we're that lucky. Well that doesn't sound especially wonderful, does it? Hmm, strange big bloody hole there. Curious. Alright, well, let's grab the bronze semiconductor. Now. Oh, look at that. Ah, a save point. That's convenient. Right, anyway guys, I'm going to drop a save there. When we come back, I guess we are going to fix the centrifuge. Um, so, thank you very much for watching guys, and as always, till next time.